Hello everyone, my name is David, you're watching David Day, and the new setup, my room is all done. Hey, it looks nice. Yeah, it looks very nice. Now you can see the poster, now you can see my figures, my statues, and all that shit. But I'm not here, we're not here for this. We're here to play 5 minutes a day. Another game made by Andrea Pignatario, and I swear, I, I, I hope, I really hope, then I get this, oh, okay, just another day in your ordinary life. Uh, try to remember what you dream. Take a shower, okay, let's take a shower. No matter how hard you try, you can recall anything from last night. A shower will surely help you uh, to clear up your mind. Uh, you have something important to do today. Also, so, this game is time-based, so as you can see, I have time to do the stuff. And I know that this game, it can repeat itself. Today you you have to deliver the quarterly report. Uh, okay, uh, check your report one last time, just in case. So I know uh, this game is based on that. Like I need to take quick decisions uh, because I have time to make them. Uh, and I know that this game can repeat itself if you never reach the end. So I hope I really hope that I reach the end because I've seen in on Twitter and wait a moment. You're getting late, okay, uh, call a taxi. Uh, I, I, I've i seen on Twitter that uh, Andrea has been watching Let's Players and YouTubers play this game and they never finished the game, so there's an ending to, to this, so if they never reach the end it's because they were doing something wrong. And I hope I'm not. There's too much traffic in the streets, you decide to walk up to your workplace. Okay, uh, rush to the building. Uh, quick, you might be late as hell. Grab your phone from the porch to check what time is it. Run up the stairs like there's no tomorrow. Of course. The room is empty. The shutters are down. The lights are out. Search for the clues to understand what happened or exit the room and go back home. Uh, let's search for clues to understand what happened. So, like I said, I hope, I, I really hope that I get it right and that I can finish it because I know that I'm not going to be able to finish it ever if I don't reach here. Uh, the door locks behind you. On its inner side there are blood traces. Follow the traces leading behind you. Try to break the door down. Uh, okay, try to break the door down. I want to get out of here. Suddenly you begin to feel a pressure in your head. Slap your face to stay focused. Crouch. Okay, I'll slap my face. You lose conscious consciousness before you could do anything. Let that your smell uh, wake up by the, your, the sour smell. You open your eyes finding yourself on the metal floor. Almost like a drench in an odorless liquid. It seems to be water. Around you there are pipes and basins of what seems to be a chemical facility. Follow... No, find the exit and go outside. I want to get out of here. So I really hope that I reach the end somehow. And if you're wondering, yes, my fucking hair is a mess. Wait a moment. You're finally outside. It's night and it's raining. Find a place to take a shelter. Okay, yes. You find an abandoned cabin where you take shelter from the rain. Quickly wait for the rain to stop. Look around for something useful, I guess. My hair is a fucking mess, and if you feel like my voice is different, it's because I'm a little, little bit sick. Uh, a light outside the cabin keeps getting bigger and bigger. Hide yourself in the dark, take a better look through the broken window, or keep searching the cabin. Uh, hide myself in the dark. And uh, I'm a little bit sick. I've been partying like for seven days straight because it was uh, my hometown festivities and blah blah blah. I, I said that in the last year also. And yes, I'm a little bit sick. So if I cough or if my voice sounds weird, it, it's mainly because of that. Because I haven't been sleeping a lot. The light outside came from a lamplight carried by a tall man in a black trench coat. You can see his face. Stay put against this further wall from the cabin entrance. Find a better place to hide. Okay, I'm gonna stay put against. Yeah, I don't. I don't want to move because it's the, it's the typical thing that when I move, he comes in and he gets me and I get murdered. The man is right outside the cabin, loading a rifle. Hold your breath or die. At least try. Fuck, this is intense. 
Uh, the man is now inside the cabin calling your name. Apparently, he's after you. Yeah, no shit. Excuse for the top of your lungs, calling for help. No. Ooh, none of those are good ideas. Bunch the man, I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Wake up. He said, What? Stay asleep just for a moment. Realize it's already morning and jump out of your bed. What? Please don't tell me that this is like the infinite loop. No, no, I, I really, I really want to get to the end of this game because I've seen that Andrea is pretty pissed that no one can reach the end of this game, and I really want to because I'm, I want to think that I'm smarter. Just another day, yeah, yeah, blah, blah, blah. Try to remember what you dream. Let's see, no matter how you try, you can recall anything from last night. A shower will surely help you clear up your mind. Enjoy through our through your, my shower. I don't know. Oh my god, I want to be smarter than everyone else. Because I'm am I a, a woman? Today you have to deliver the quarterly report, okay? Since there's not gonna be anyone in the fucking office, I'm gonna spend more time fixing my hair. Maybe I... Maybe somehow I came too early. <laughs> <coughs> Shit. Need to drink some water. Okay. I don't know. You're getting late. Let's walk to my workplace. Like I said, maybe I came out, I came early, early, so, I don't know. Or instead of rushing it and be the first one there, and I don't know, it's just so weird. There's too much traffic, okay, uh, walk quickly but with dignity. Yeah, quick, you might be late as hell. Grab your phone from the porch to check. What time is it? Uh, yes, let's do that, I don't know. The room is empty, the shutters are down, the lights are out. Uh, exit the room and go back home. Fuck it. Fuck it. I don't want to know what happened here. I don't want to know anything about it, about this at all. So, fuck it. I'm out. So, what's going to be now? The, obviously, the door is going to be closed. The door locks behind you. On its inner side, there are both traces. Uh, oh, that's... Try to pick the doors. Lock with a hairpin, yeah. I think that is way better than the other thing. Suddenly you begin to feel a pressure in your hair, crouch down the floor and start to scream. Why? You lose consciousness before you could do anything. Wake up by those strange noises instead of the sour smell. You open your eyes and you say, ah, yeah, this is fine. Oh, shit. Follow the liquid trails on the floor. Let's see where they lead me. This is so weird. This is so weird. I, I, if you guys can see, I'm now picking the opposite that I've been picking in the last try. So I don't know, man. I don't know. You're finally outside. It's night. It's raining. Run towards a light in the woods before you. That's the man. You find an abandoned cabin where you take shelter from the rain. Quietly wait for no. Uh, look. Or, quietly wait for the rain to stop. I've been looking around, so I don't know. A light outside. Take a better look through the broken window. I'm gonna see that there's a man, and he's carrying a rifle. So I'm gonna freak out. I'm gonna start screaming. I'm gonna pee myself, and I don't know what else. <laughs> Shit, uh, this is, ah, uh, I don't know what, I uh, because later in the other try I've been picking up the light outside come from the lamp, uh, yeah, 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 you can see his face, find a better place to hide, I guess. In the last try, I've been picking, uh, the options that I need, that I think, not that I need, that, that I think that are more reasonable, so now I'm going to choose the opposite. 
A man is right outside the cabin loading a rifle. Look for your for a back door. Look for your breath. Where is my breath? Ah, oh, Gail. Oh, Jesus. The man is inside. Yeah. A scream from the top of my lungs. Maybe someone will hear me. Apparently, he's after you. And I'm gonna wake up. Fuck. Seriously, just five more minutes. Let's see here. What am I doing wrong? Am I supposed like to enjoy myself? I don't understand. What am I doing wrong? Fuck! I don't want to be wrong. Look around for something useful. Let's see if I can find anything useful. Either way, I'm gonna be fucked. So, keep searching the cabin. What What else can I do? Let's think about this, guys. Let's think about this. What can I do, actually? To, f to finish it. I'm trying all the options now, so... The liar side came back from black carry by a tall man in a black trench coat. You can see his face. Look for a stone to, sh to sharp a metal scrap you found. This is new. Okay. Maybe we're gonna reach the end. Baha! I don't think so. But... Shard the metal scrap with a stone fragment stuck between between two floorboards. Okay. Let's let's get ready for the fight. I don't know. Start the man with the sharpened metal scrap when he's not facing you. Fuck yeah. Let's try that. Let's try that. Yeah! You successfully stopped the man, ran away, and found a car passing by the nearest road. You never knew why or who kidnapped, kidnapped you. Kidnapped you! Fuck! When the police arrived at the cabin, the man was gone. What? Even the blood stained metal scrap was nowhere to be found. There were no traces left, and no chemical plants were, near, were never being built in that area. What the shit? Your boss waited for the report all the day. You've been risked being fired. You even you even risked being fired. Despite all this, you were finally happy. For the first time, you remembered your dream. What the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> okay, so that was five minutes a day. They don't. Uh... I don't know. And this is gonna crash. Of course, obviously. Thank you. Uh, what the fuck? What the fucking fuck? I don't know if I'm too tired. Or maybe I killed half of my brain partying or something, but ah, uh, I don't, I don't get anything. Why, why? I mean, I understand that it was all just a dream, but why the five more minutes? Why everything looping? Why I had a, that fucking weird dream? Why? Just, there's just one big question. Why? Why? Oh my god, I don't understand anything. But anyway, just that pipe my fucking hair. That was five minutes today. I hope that you guys enjoyed. Like always, Andrea. I don't know, man. I don't know what to tell you. I don't fucking know what to tell you. But good job. Good job. Yes, good job. Uh, once again, you somehow find found the way to fuck my mind. To mind fuck me. I don't know. I don't know. Congratulations again on your job. <laughs> 
Anyway, that is all for today. So like always, I hope that you guys enjoyed. Link in the description for you to play it. Uh, but you already already seen the end, so it doesn't make it much sense that you play it now. But anyway, that is all. So like always, thank you so much for watching. Click the other videos that I thought. Hit that like button and remember to take a day. A day. Five more minutes, I guess. <laughs> bye bye. Even control it. I can't. So that's why I'm fucking wearing a fucking hat in the middle of the summer, dying and sweating my balls off. But it is what it is. So let's play it. Let's play it. It's stuff about my hat and my life. You don't even need to worry about it.